Is kissing like this. <laughs> the third gear is the gear that brings the hand of your love. Myself, why are roses the flower of love and not margaritas? Because it's actually to the margaritas that we ask if you're being loved or not. 
then I think maybe it's roses because if you want to hold on to them, it hurts. Anyway, I would much rather just walk into a bar, ask for a million margaritas and go, loves me, loves me not, loves me not. <laughs> Why is love like a riot in the heart? Why, why is love like a revolution that comes and takes you? Como un golpe de estado que viene y te destroza. I hear in Finland or Denmark or Sweden or I don't know which developed country, they invented black tulips. In California they created square tomatoes because they fit better in the box. <laughs> why don't they invent roses without thorns? or love without pain. I'm 33 years old. When I was six, we were celebrating New Year's Eve with my family and we started imagining how old we were going to be in the year 2000. It turned out to be that my father was going to be 83, my mother was going to be 73, and I was going to be 33. <coughs> 33, I thought. I'm going to know it all. I'm going to have all the answers. I'm going to be an adult. I am now 33 years old and I still don't understand. How can this be that my life seems to depend in the distance between my lover and me? And if my lover sits three centimeters too far or stays in the telephone five minutes too long or stops in the street to say hello to a friend, then immediately is the total disaster in my vida is vuelve upside down completamente. But then if my lover looks at me with shining eyes or writes me incredible love letters or phones me in the middle of the night, then I go, yes, arrancame la vida, abraza. Philosophers, songwriters, poets, playwrights, everybody here seems to be busy with love. The love is blind, love is in the air, all you need is love. Everybody says amazing things about love, but nobody here gives me an answer. Why is that exist the Convention of Vienna, the Convention of Genève, the Convention of Utrecht, and nobody invents a convention about love? And don't look at me that way, because I know this concerns you too. I am going here for answers everywhere. I go to tarot readers, fortune tellers, Everybody says to me, I should stop thinking. How can I possibly stop thinking if this thing is bothering me? Why is everybody this in politics, with pollution, with the price of the broccoli in the supermarket, mobile fucking telephones, and nobody here gives me an answer. My father and my mother, they did it 40 years. What I do in two months, two weeks. Last time, it took me 45 minutes to go through the whole thing. You want to get me? Come on, come on. You want to get me? Come on, come and get me. Come and get me.